this is the this is the movement there. I get up here, I cheat there to make to force him that way. When he goes that way, I'm in there, controlling him there. Look, 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 I'm not fouling him at all, I'm controlling him. But he don't forget when he comes up to go by me, he'll stop, he'll hold the ball for two yards at least in front of me. He won't bring it up so and right up here. He'll take two two yards, so he'll have two steps before he goes by me. He's only another two and his brain is telling him he has to get rid of the ball, okay? So I will have him, just, you do the same thing, nice and slowly, fake this side and go that side. So I'm there, so he goes that way. I'm in there, straight in there, taking him away and stripping the ball, okay? With the near hand all the time. So that's my movement there. He goes that way, I go there. Go that way, I go there. I lead with the foot. And we should be doing that in a warm up so it just becomes over a month, six weeks, a year, it just becomes part of your brain. You come to the guy, you go that way. A lot of guys, when they're coming up, coming to me, and he fakes, go fake that way and go that way, their, their natural reaction is that. It's a foul straight away. And if you, it's so simple that if he did that to me, I'm going to go by that side there. Yeah. I, well, I'd go this side because the hip is strong. Yeah. I go about that, and you put your hand across me, I will then control him. He's nowhere to go. I'll go by him with the ball. Just control, he's fucked. So what I'm saying is, he's in trouble. So he's fake there, got, and I, I'm le left him for dead. I'm going by him. He puts that hand out to stop me. I'm just doing that. Ball is in that. I'm, I'm, I can t pick my... So, there's lots of, lots of times. So what I'm trying to do is, I avoid that. He goes that side. I take with him. Bang, I'm in there too. Two times, two steps, he's only another two. And his brain is wired to. We don't count four steps when we're solo or uh, running with the ball. We don't count four <laughs> steps. The brain just tells you, you know, this is the time, you're, you're going to overcarry it. And you'll nearly see it with, some, with guys that do it. So the point I'm making is you take that, you move one, two, you bang, you're right in there. He's taking his first two coming to go by me, I've, instead of me doing this, look at one, two, and having to chase them, I just do that. There, I'm cutting them off. I'm taking the two yards ahead of them. Does that make sense, fellas? Simple ply, isn't it? Simple little thing. So we we'll walk through that again. You come up there, fake there, go there, one, two. Whereas if I do this, go there, fake that way, if I go, I'm, I'm going to be chasing them if I'm going across with this foot. But by dropping this way, I'm coming into them, knocking them, holding them out. No referee, and you're not pulling a dragon because your, ball, your emphasis is on the ball, okay? So that's what I'm going to work with them in, in initially in, in the warm up here. So I'm going to do that now. Take two steps back from that line. Very good. Two steps. One, two. Stay there. Who's, are you a defender, no? You look like a defender here, you're savage looking. Take two steps back. Okay, now, when I say, bang, you're going to solo up there and go, and go by him. And I want you to turn. So he's going to run up to me. I want you to go that side of him, solo. And I want you to drop this foot here, look at that foot there, I don't want you to step like that. Yeah. I want you to, to come up to him. You're going to try and meet him there, meet him in there. And when you get close to him, I want you to drop that and run alongside him and sprint to that. So you know what you're going to do. So let me see you, let me see you drop. Okay, okay, that's not bad. Okay, now hold on, hold on. Did you step back and run with him? Okay, so that's what you're expecting him to do, and he milled you then instead, right? So you just do what I'm asking you here. Yeah. I want you to step back, but beat him to that line. Okay, okay. Yeah. but you have to move forward as well yeah. initially. So you're go walking, go walking slowly. You're moving there, and at that stage you drop and go, right? Alongside him, over alongside him, right? Go. That's it, okay, okay. 
That's, that's the beginning of the thing. Okay, there's no pulling or dragging there, but he, he's get, so in a warm up, you can get them doing that, okay? Constantly, two minutes of it every, every day, over weeks and weeks and weeks. It's then built in, it's an automatic. It's an implicit learning and they just do it. They'll drop that leg and go. Okay, so give, give me the ball here now, fellas. So you're just going to come over to me here and going to demonstrate here. If I, if I, when he has the ball there, and he's come, if he's, if he's so, just getting the ball, sorry, you throw him the ball, please, when I tell you. So now, he's getting the ball, I'm the defender, I see he's going to get the ball, go on, walk, walk, I'm coming up to him, I want to get as close to him as possible, but if he's moving that way, I have him where I want him, okay? But, if he moves at me straight, so move at me straight, and all I'll do is that and knock the ball, right, and I'm gone, okay? So, what I did was, I, I, I moved his hand off the ball, there, and struck, right? Simple, no pulling or dragging. So, you see the way the ball came away so easily there? So, he's going to try and do that to, me, to you. He clattered you the last time, but no, I don't want, where is he? I don't want body contact here now, I don't want you to mill him. I just want you to come up gently, you let him do that because we're working on him, not you. So let's go, come up to him, you meet him, push, that's it, that's it, that's it, simple as that. But don't let the ball go now this, that easy this time, right? But go, go easy what moving with the ball. Okay, so you see, he's not concentrating on pulling or dragging. He's turning, he's in there with the ball, okay? So, we're all going to work on that there, fellas, just for the final part of the warm-up. Get into pairs, backs and forwards, it doesn't matter whether you're a back or not, you work on that. Try and drop that leg and run, okay? And, and always go away from the middle here, that way you won't run into each other. Yo, you okay? Yeah. You have to play the ball. You have to play the ball, you can't run 50 yards with the ball, that's it. Go. Now, that's it, now get up alongside him. Could you not work? For yes, you fucking idiot. Right. Okay. Now you, you change it over and let him do that. <sighs> Don't forget. To That's it. That okay. So what, what, did you, what did you do that I didn't want you to do? You, you hit him with what arm? So if you missed him, you were shagged. Do you know what I mean? If you missed that, you're shy, you're here. If he, if he went by you like this, look at, come, you, you walk, you go by me. You went, he went by you like that and you missed there. You're in, in trouble, but look at, by him, go by me, by him getting up in here and, and moving in there, he's always with you, do you know what I mean? Okay, okay fellas, so, so these are not getting it. Some of them are, some of them aren't, but they're, 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 they're working on the ball. Fellas, th this is the thing I want you to do here, right? When you turn left that way, when you drop there and you're alongside them that way, which arm should you use? The nearest arm. Bang. You're not going across them because look, this is what happens if you go across them in this movement. If he gets by you there, you're shagged. You have to then take one, two, three to follow him. Whereas if, if you just take that in there and you're in there, you can keep going with him, even if he keeps the ball, you're still alongside him. You still have him under your control. So the near hand in, if, whatever side they go, if he goes left, you drop the right leg and go in, in with him. If he goes right, you drop the left leg and in with the right hand. So near hand into the ball, let's go. Just work on it. <laughs> You have to solo, you can't put the ball under your oxter and run after him, you got to solo. That's it, that's it, I had the wrong, ah, ah. First of all, you have your left hand on them, fouling them, and you're pawing with the right hand. You've got to turn with him, turn with him and get in with the left hand, and keep him out, keep him out. That's it. So he's under, he's controlling this guy. This guy is faster than him, he's a forward, he's probably a good forward by the, by the looks of him, and this guy is controlling him there. It's a simple technique, isn't it? And, and by doing that, you're taking them out of the, the, the mindset of pulling and dragging. But don't be afraid if it takes a, a month or so. 
and want is a minor detail in the rest of their life. Okay, that's yeah, yeah. Well done there, Superman. Okay, so come in here now, fellas. Here, this uh, I'm boring you a little bit here, but tell me this: Did you find it a lot harder to get by them then when you when, when you worked with an air hand in, and you're always in control? He's always in control of you. Do you know what I mean? You love almost have to check back and come back that way and when you do that this is all you do check back and go out that way I just drop back that way there and I'm in there again so it's a technique you should particularly defenders should do it but Dublin senior football forwards now do that that's why they press the man whatever the ball is the nearest man press them bang corner forward full forward nails him puts him under pressure so he just can't walk out and give a ball a nice handy ball so the movement is that, fellas. When you're waiting for your mother to finish the dinner, don't be afraid to be out the back there. Just be moving. Walk that way, OK? Moving, walk that way. Now, it's not smooth here because I have a sore knee and I just had a hip five weeks ago. So I shouldn't be doing this kind of stuff. But the movement is there, bang, and bang, in alongside. And you find that you're always in control of them. If you're as quick as them, or nearly as quick as them, you're holding them there without pulling them and your hand is free and then if he checks back there you drop that way again you don't run around in a bleeding circle over after him you, you know you, you track him back that way again and move him that way that won't happen overnight but it's a good it's a good skill so tell me this do you think you'd like to have that skill okay would as a forward would you want your defenders to have that skill so why would you want that they're going to foul less, aren't they? And they're going to always have the man under pressure. So that, that's going to help your team. So the more you work with each other, and initially the forward should, when the, the guy, whoever the forward is, even if you're the forward in the, in the, drill, in the activity, you should, the, the guy that's the defender is the guy you're working, not you. So you're not trying to impress him by going by him. You're trying to make him very good. So you're doing it at three quarter motion until he's good at it. And then when he starts to say, oh, I have you licked, that's when you, you up your, up your ante, you know? okay? So we're going to go into a game here, fellas, now, straight away. We're going, many have it, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Okay, we're going to have one goalkeeper. Have we a keeper? No. Where? So you're the defender. Well done, yeah, boy, you're here. He's a goalkeeper here, fellas. Now we have a corner back. Okay, so you're going to walk in there, and the way the team that's playing that way, the yellow will play that way. The yellow will play that way. You have to score a goal. You can't do anything else. You have to score a goal. This is just a warm up game. And the other guys are playing the other way. You've got to get a pass to one of your men on the, over that line there. See the line? See the line just behind uh, Superman there? That line, you've got to play, walk the ball up to there and get another word. So if I'm coming up here this way, somebody has to get in behind that line on my team and receive a pass. That's, the, that's how you score. If it doesn't happen, you walk it back out again. And, okay? So let's, let's get, let's get our, I'll, I'll throw the ball in here. Oh, okay. Let's get the rest of the balls out of the way, fellas. Yeah, you go ahead. I'm going to be talking to these guys. Don't just, don't kill us. Just walk them, fellas. Walk them. There's the shot. Bang. Well done. Play it, play it, play it. Shut them down. One of you, one of you, one of you. Oh, does it take two to mark one? Yeah, one of you. Okay. So to see the guy that let him by there. He's all the time in space, he's never tight, and he's, he's, and he's, he's always double, he's, he's not picking up his own man. Watch. Well done, just walk him, you have him, well done. No foul, that's it there, well done, well done. Who's looking? What's happening here, hey? Hold that. Hey, fellas, no point, in, where's the, the guys playing this, playing up that way? The reds, Yellow. the yellows. No point you've been up there and they heading for your goal. Do you know what I mean? Well, you have to make the transition there. Same with you, Superman. You were much closer. You know, you have to read where the danger is. I read the danger here and I'm blind and 
deaf. And I read the danger here and I'm looking, where's the mat? Nobody. So stay awake here, fellas. Take that ball off the ground there, out of the way. Keep it in your hand. They're going to run by you. Stay inside them. Well done. Stay. Don't foul them. Don't foul them. Well done. You get on him. That's it. That's it. Get back on his mat. That's it. Well done. Walk him. Stay. On. Keep him outside. Keep him outside. Get in on him. You get closer. You're too. Okay. That's a miss, of course. They're going for goals. They can only score with goals. That's a bad shot. Under pressure. So listen, fellas. I want you now as defenders, when, when, when the opposition have the ball, you have to switch into a defensive mode here. Keep them outside, keep, get the near hand in at them, let's get working, okay? Strip the ball if you can. Keep them out, don't, don't panic, don't panic, you have them. You have him, work with him, work with him. Okay, never turn your back like that. See the point I'm making? Yeah. See that point where he turned around? I told you that's what they'll do. We get them out of that. Just that, that movement, it becomes a, uh, an automatic movement and they'll be checking. Okay, fellas, now. We're going to reverse this here now. The colours are playing the opposite way. The keeper stays in. Colours, so which way are you playing there, uh, yellow? You're playing out. You're playing in, you're playing out. Okay, you're defending. Okay, so you understand what you're doing there now, right? Now, this time, fellas, when you have possession, whoever has possession has to take a solo with the ball. You, mu you must take the solo before you pass it. So hold on. What does that mean for the defenders? It's an opportunity. You know that he has beaten you. He's not going to wait you. You know he has to, has to solo. Get in there and dispossess him. Turn him around again. Let me out of here. I can't run here. Let me. Walk, don't fail him. Don't fail him. Walk him. Walk him. Don't fail him. Come on, get over. Turn him out. Turn him out. Turn him out. Turn him out. Come on, you've got to read what's happening there. The shot's on, the shot was on. Fellas, what, what are you shooting for? For what? Goal, so it was a bad shot, was it? What? Okay, that's just, a, just as long as the audience know there that that was for a goal, you know? I wouldn't let you away with that feeling good for doing something badly. To make you good at doing it badly, you know? Don't fail them, don't fail them. Look at fellas, yeah. You, well done, well done. Help it. Yeah, that's it. Walk him. Walk him. Walk him. Don't. That's it. Oh, lovely move. That foul. Well done. Well done. Good shot. Good save. Yeah, yellow's working out. Okay. Staying the same way, fellas. You have another two minutes here. The only condition here is you have the only pass you can make is a foot pass. Now, defenders, I want to see you obliterating them. The only pass you can make is a foot pass. Pardon? Still doing the solo? Yeah. Yeah. Still doing the solo as well. Don't fail them, son. Don't fail them. See the automatic, the the, the automatic pull, and uh, it's crazy, because referees will give the free, and you're dead. Get, get in and block there, fellas. He's got a foot pass. And block him. Block the foot pass. That's it. That's it. That's it. No, that's not a score. How do you score? No, you pass it to somebody behind the line. That's the rule, fellas. One of your teammates has to get around, has to read what you're doing, get around the other side of the line. Let's go. So, do you understand? You're all the time making them think here, fellas, and you're changing the, the ball, the game, all the time. 
Well done. Well done, son. Don't fail him. Don't fail him. Work him. He's got a foot pass. So block him. Block him. Come on, get in and block the foot pass, fellas. You know he has the foot pass. Get in at it. You can actually see the standard of them. They're quite good, you know. Fucking, I don't end up in hospital. Give it over, give it over. Why has it been given over, keeper? Simple, isn't it? Let's see, will he do it again here now? Walk him, walk him. Get in on the block, he's got him. Oh, he, you had him dead. He has to kick past it, get the block. Hey. Yellow ball. I'm a good whistler, that's about it. Couldn't play football for notes, but good whistler. Now, you have him dead, he's got to kick it, he's got to kick it. That's a great pass. That was a great pass now. Saw that guy screwed around the corner to him. Okay now fellas. Okay. So is there much dispossession going on here? Not a lot. Is there much tackling? Well, they're, they're, they're shedding them, but there's a lot of there's a lot of uh, marking closely. So how would we make this work a bit better for the defence? No, I'm going to put them into a more confined area. Okay. Okay. You're going to work, fellas, and that goal there. See those goals? So I don't want anybody not getting tackled. So get in onto them. They have to get in here. And you have to be in the square to score. I'll, I'll take care of you, Keeper. That was a good save. You had a couple of good saves and a very good pass out here. Okay, we're playing this way here, fellas, right? So it's a narrower area, so let's shut them down. And fellas, you can, you can solo any amount you like, or you don't have to solo at all, but you must foot pass. And you defensively, let's turn them and get in and block the ball. Right, let's go. You're on. Don't let him in, don't let him in, he's got his kick. Oh, you, okay. Well done, well done. Okay there, defender here. Who, who's the guy turned his back there? You don't have to panic on this one. You don't have to charge in, you had him dead. You know, don't give him an opportunity to turn, just relax. Police him. Now, now you walk him, don't fail, don't, you walk him. Get, here, here's pick him up. That's it. Block him, block him. Nah, well done, well done. Well done. Get back here. here this has got... <laughs> what are you looking at? Hand pass, hand pass, fellas. Okay. Okay, very good. So I suspect here, fellas, that there's more forwards than backs. Forwards and midfielders, put your hands up. I suspected that. Anyway, that's it. You, you need to defend, be able to defend as well, fellas. You've got to bring defence into your repertoire. Oh, well done. I'd say he overcarried that ball, did he? Did you? Okay, okay. So, look at... So, the defender did well. To, don't foul him, fellas. You have him dead. 
He has to kick a block, block, block. Stay up, stay up, he has to shoot, don't be worried. Oh, great. Well done. Okay, just keep playing, fellas, keep playing. But this time now, you can't solo, you can't hop the ball. You've got to make the pass as soon as you get it. One touch, get the ball, give it. With your foot. Oh, hold on, hold on. You have to know here that he had to kick it. So you don't have to be charging past him. Don't give him the opportunity. You know he has to kick the ball. So get over close to him and you judge which side he's going to kick with it. If he's right footed, he's generally going to go that side. Okay, so you've got to read that, fellas. Right here, I'm going to give a back. Go ahead. Now be patient. You have him. He has to kick it. Don't felt Get up beside him because he, you know he has to kick it. Now stay it. That's it. Now, what do you see happening here now, fellas? Because they have to kick it. They're not getting the passes in. They're kicking them long now because they know they're under pressure. So they'll have to, they'll have to make that adjustment or they're never going to get the ball. Oh. Well done, well done. Don't foul them, don't foul them. Well done, well done. Next ball. I'd say, would that be a foot block? Would that have been a penalty? Okay now fellas, there's nobody marking here, okay? Pick a man, walk with him, let's go. Hold that, give me that ball. Pick a man and walk with him. I don't want to see loose men here. Right, the game is on. That's more like it. Get over, get on him to hell. That's more like it. Don't be, get on him, get on him. Well done. I, I, I'd be, I'd be, is that, would that be a penalty, no? That, wouldn't they? Yeah. You need to break that old habit there, kid. Block him, he has to kick, get the right side. Okay, hold it up. Keeper can't come out so he can't get the ball back. Once it's in play, he can't get it unless from the opposition, okay? Go. Now follow him, you follow him, don't foul him. That's you. you get in. Block him, block him, he's got to shoot. Well done. He's got to shoot there, fellas, you've got to be that side of him. It's very difficult now to teach defensive stuff to forwards, you know. The, the, the one or two backs that are there are tackling, the, you know, but the rest aren't. See, they, they just, they don't know how to get in and block. They don't, the, the, that skill is, is bereft here, isn't it? We need to, we need to work on that. Okay. Oh, come on, fella. Listen, I block those shots myself. You know he has to hit it. Stay inside. Get on him. Block. That's more like He can't come out. Right. He's going to get the ball back. You go in there, he's going to get the ball back from whoever he gives it to. So pick him up. Don't, don't leave him there. 
Now, just get the right side of him, fellas. Just get the right side of him. Don't be... He's... Let him get it. Let him get it. He's dead. He's dead. He did, we didn't even block that, fellas. You had him in a corner. That goalkeeper's getting away. I think he's, he's getting away with it in games. Oh, he wouldn't be doing it so often, you know. That's, that's artificial now, fellas. It's really artificial. We need to change this one. No, that's a Hail Mary. That was a Hail Mary. That's it. Okay, take a break, fellas, okay? Well, we're going to go into a different game now. Okay, fellas, so tell me what, what your, what, what your uh, feelings are on that. So what, what's happening with this game? I think they're getting tired. They're just starting to put the balls up in the air. Three, well, I think it, they're not, it's, that's not because they're tired. I think because they don't want to be blocked, they're taking the easy, the easy. And but but they needn't be worried because we're we're very poor at blocking, you know. And they're they're not they're not reading how to get in close for the block, you know. You just shut down one side, so he has to go the other side, and and now he has to kick, you know. So I'm going to talk to them about that. Okay, come here for a minute here, fellas. I want you guys now to tell me how, how I can start. He has the ball there now, right? He's, the rule that was in there that he has to kick it, right? So what should, what should I do here? How can I get a block at it? I know he has to kick it. So just, just walk through the action of kicking. I need to be able to get over there and do that. Look, it's simple. But you need to be switched on to it, okay? So that's simple there. Right, you need to do that. So, how can you make that happen to make it easier for yourself to block him? Pardon? Yeah, always mark him. But when he has the ball, what would you what would you do? No, you see, the danger about getting really close is that's what you want. If I get really close here now, you'll you'll put, go out there and do it. What I want you to do is, I want you to for this. He's a uh, you're left for a guy, are you? That's what I said, you're right for it. So you're going to want to go to that space, right? Yeah. So I'll cheat off that. Okay. I'll cheat off. Are you, are you, you know you have to kick. Are you going to kick with your right foot there now? So I know, I should know that you have to kick and you have to kick it now. Once I'm this close, do you know what I mean? Because you can't run with it. So you need to start reading that and just get in, close, bang, move over there and get down on that. You won't block it from up here or standing out here. You've got to move in on the ball. So in other words, we go through that motion there. I'm, I'm cutting off his right foot, so I'm going to get over there and get in there. Simple. This is simple, fellas, but it's in the head. And unless you, you, you understand that and do it and read that, you're never going to be doing it. And the reason for, for breaking down here so much is because most of your forwards. How often do you block in games? How often are you a forward? How often would you block a man in a game? You? So, you know, and, and can you understand how you would gain more possession and help your team by blocking a ball up in their, in their area if you, get, if you get in and read that? So, Force the guy to the area you want him. Whatever area you want him in, force him there. If you, if you cheat over here, he, you know he's going to kick the ball and he has to do it in that time. So you should get in and get it blocked. So let's work on that. And let's, the guys with the ball, don't do it really quickly and give them an opportunity to get in and get the block. But do the kick, okay? Just for two minutes, right? And the goalkeeper, what's your name? Cormac. Cormac, do you play soccer a lot? And what, do you see that your, your foot saves? Yeah. Are you ever called on them? Uh, no. Okay. So what about the guys that are shooting? Do you think that's a foul? No, okay. Yeah, I think it's a foul. I think it's a definite foot block. Anyway, 
Okay, let's get going now, fellas. You know he's going to go slower, but he's going to get it. So I want you to get in and get the block. I'm working on the block here, fellas, right? No, he has to, he ha okay. Now, fellas, as a forward, I want you to play by the rule here. Don't be taking three or four steps. I want you, when you receive it, to, to give them a chance. When, when you receive it, I want you to, to, to kick it. Even though your instinct is telling you not to. That's it. Block, block. That's better. That's better. Okay. Okay, now, you're not, nobody near him there. Fellas, you can't run with the ball. You ran from over there with the ball. I want you to play this game to this rule, that you get the ball, you kick it. And you block it. Let him get it, let him get it. Now get in and block, he's got to kick it, that's it. Get him. Get the block in. Go ahead, play it out. Don't come out, don't come out. Play it out. Get back in there and play it out. Now, one of you... <laughs> okay, I, what am I going to do here now, fellas? I'm going to take a player out. Okay. So... Okay. Right. Now, you fellas, yellow have five men to four here. So, man mark here and, and you stay loose. Everybody else man mark right through the game. And get a block in. Get a block in before I crucify you. Let's go. Oh. Let him get it and block. Don't hit me. No going back either. No passing back, right? But listen, that was a good that was good thinking to get yourself out of trouble here. Are you, what are we working on here? What are we trying to develop here? Blocking. blocking. Defending and blocking. So in order to make them better players, you know, I'm putting in more conditions. So you can't they cannot pass nobody can pass the ball back. Now you've less to worry about. They have to kick it when they get it forward, get in there quick and, and force them to go one side and block. Just concentrate on that. I want to see blocks here. Let him get it. Block him. Block him. He, he, he took two or three turns there. Block him. Blo block. <laughs> Fellas, we're walking on the defense here. Don't be trying to take moves over. Get the ball. Kick it. You guys, read that and block. Let's go. Well, yeah, let him get it. Block him. Block him. Don't be looking off. At... Okay, that was a good try anyway. Let him get it and block him. That's it. Let Block him. That's better. Okay, so they're starting out the block here, fellas. Do you understand? That's, they, weren't, they weren't blocking the top. I, I want this. This is the condition that I'm after, bringing it down to the bare minimum. Blocks, fellas. He has to hit it, and I'm going to force him to kick it. You block him. Let him get it. Don't compete with him. Don't compete with him. Jesus Christ. Now block, block. Let him get it. Now block. That's it. Don't fail him, don't fail. Block. Fellas, you didn't have to. You don't, that's it. You don't have to go in. Get the block in. Let him get it. Block him. I'm failing abysmally here, fellas. Abysmally. Are they in the county players, yeah? Are they in the county lads, yeah? Good. Okay, fellas, now listen. I don't want to insult you here. We're going to play football here. No rules. Back into the Gaelic football. You can do what you like. But I want, every time you make a block, it's three scores. Three goals every time you make a block. And you have to beat him. Whoever gets the ball has to beat him. So listen to me. If he gets the ball, yellows are defending that goal. If you get it, reds are defending it. So you have to think on your feet here. Right. Give, throw the ball up there. Stop. So 
If, if you want to get that ball off him, why would you compete with him there? You know, what's the rule? What's he got to do when he gets the ball? Kick the, kick the ball. So listen, see if I was you, I'd be waiting for him to come down. And I'd cheat to one side, so when he comes down, he's going to have to kick that side. Bang. Instead of going up, he beats you, you're out of the game, but then a guy comes to meet him, and he, he's the piggy in the middle. So let him get the ball. But nail him. Block it. Block it. You don't have to kill him. Just block it. Now get in, get you, get the side you want them. Yeah, too late. There's no one on those talking just saying that there's ten to and these fellas are supposed to go with their own court. Just another few minutes. Okay, no okay, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know what I was thinking there? Do you know what these fellas were talking about fitness? Remember last year you did two on two and it's fifty minutes ago. Remember that? Sorry, sorry what? Come out here. Yeah, yeah, in a square, yeah, yeah, yeah. And what are we working on there? Yeah, for these, I think these are pro players. Now. That's a good goal there. Good, good shot. Now let them, let them talk. Fellas, they're not reading this game. I, I'm surprised at this. Ah! Fellas, I know, I know what you're doing there. But we're, we're working on making our teammates better defenders, right? So that's why the condition is in. If, you, if they're expecting the condition and then you cheat and take them on. You're good at that, but I want you to, don't be afraid to be blocked. Don't be afraid to be blocked. We're working on the block, right? Last minute. I want two blocks in the next minute. Don't, fella, hold on. How the hell is he loose there, fellas? That's why he's loose. That's my fault. Yeah, okay. So listen, fellas. You're the guys I want to let them get the ball, and you defend, right? So the yellows defend. Let the reds get the ball, right? What? Whoever gets the ball goes in there. I'm going to give the ball to this guy so the team will be playing that way, right there. Ah! You know, he, I, I'm, I'm putting in a rule so that he, you know, and, and your, your instinct is very good, but it's stopping you from doing it, you know what I mean? Yeah. Block! Get in! Block, fellas! That's better! I want to get you in there! Don't film! Block him! Hold on! Hold on! See that pass you get there? You knew you were going to be blocked. You left it down low and you didn't give a shit who you gave it to. Do you understand? So you gave the ball away and he didn't get the chance to block you. We're trying to make him a better player so that when you get scores up front, he's going to stop from the other end. Okay. Do you understand the point? But your instinct is good. I'm trying to make you be able to change that at, at an instant, right? Let's go. Now, okay. Now let him get it and block. Don't be uh, block. That's it. Well done. Block again. Okay. Listen, we're out of here. I'm, I'm failing abysmally. But the point that I'm making is, I'm putting, I'm putting in conditions. I'm trying to make it lopsided, five versus four. But these guys blocking, and that's it's just not one of the fortes. They're just they don't block. They don't even read what the how to block or when to go in. I mean. I, I went in there and I said to them, look, fellas, let him get the ball. He, he's only one step to kick the ball. Read that. None of them did that. They still competed small against big, you know. So the decision making there is what's killing this. Bad decision making. So we need to, you know, get them aware and work them in situations like that. Not, there's no point in getting them. But, but see, with these guys, you probably would need to get them blocking tentatively because they haven't done it coming up. You know, passing the ball to them, me get, getting the ball to you, give me a ball, throwing it to you and telling you you have to shoot from there and me getting in and blocking. 
they, that's the, the, the level that they need to go back down to here. They just don't have, they're not reading blocks. You know, we're working on blocks, they're the rules, and they're tackling all the time. They're tackling badly, they're going in and been shed. Every one of them have been shed. So the bad tacklers and the bad blockers, but the mostly forwards. But nevertheless, a forward should be able to block and tackle. You have to be, that's their, their skills in the game and you need to teach them. And I actually, what I had planned for tonight, and you have to be able to move away from it, I'll just tell you now what I had planned. I wanted to work on the fence, but I knew, I knew taking the fence on, uh, t uh, defending, because it's rarely taught. It's rarely taught. It's all, it's taught by get them, tackle them, blah, blah, you know. It's not taught by movement and zeroing in on it in a game situation. Anyway, I was going to work, we did, we explained the tackle fairly well. You got the kind of, the technique for moving with the guy and shutting them down, etc. A uh, couple of conditions then. I was going to go then into uh, four, four versus four, with four guys on the outside of the, of the thing. I thought we'd have 12 guys. And then they, the, the four on the outside would act as wall passes. Whoever gave them the ball got it back. So they weren't on any team. Whoever, if we're playing here and he shuts me down, I can give it off to him. So I have to think of another option. But I, I don't have to get it back from him, but he can only give it back to my team. So I can move on and then somebody else can read that and come in and get that pass. So you're all the time challenging them. And you keep it at a high intensity. After three minutes, take out one of the teams. That four goes on as one of the teams. And that way you're going to get two games of six minutes at that intensity. So that, that would be a brilliant fitness activity. But maybe another time anyway. So uh, th that was that. And then I would have had another one. The third one, see the semicircles there? That I would have allowed a forward in there. Nobody else allowed to go in there. Only the forward. And have four v four out here. And in order to score, they had to get the ball into the forward and one of their teammates would have to get it back and shoot on an open goal. So, so everybody would have to read this, that when the pass, well, you can put in conditions that you have to make three passes initially or none. Um, but if you make three passes, they know then after the three passes, they, they have to find this guy from now on before they can score. So you, they, can, they can start to read that and the forwards, who are working with them in possession, they know that they have to get him, so somebody has to read that and get up, get it back off him to score. They don't have to shoot, but they have to get it back off him to score. So you're, you're putting in condition that's making them think and making them switch on to different games. That's, that's what I'm trying to do with people. I'm trying to get them to get into game and think about just, when you're sitting at home there instead of looking at stupid television for 10 or 15 minutes, think of what, how you could put in a situ game situation the next time you go out with your team and do that every week there. You'll build up a repertoire of them yourself. You'll, you'll start to, and then you'll start to, to, to twitch them during games and that. Okay, it's just an introduction to the thing, folks. So I hope that, uh, are there any skeptics left? Don't be afraid. Uh, have, I not, have I convinced you that there is merit in going to wherever possible game situations? no matter how small they are. And I've given you all the scientific baloney about that supports it all. Do you know what I mean? Okay, folks, listen, thanks very much. Okay. Thank you.